log house over uh, that the museum now owns, and uh, it uh, it was it was in the log house of, uh, where the Crawford farm was, and my my dad the uh, the farm over there where I grew up was originally belonged to the Crawfords, and it was uh, this. This is will separate between the top and the bottom here. But anyway, the desk is uh, real old. Uh, the fellow that redone it for me, he thought late 1700s, but that's going way too far back. I, but anyway, it's an old desk and it's put in by pins. It's uh, it's uh, if you see here, it's got pins. It's uh, been hand hand built and uh, curly maple. And uh, it's it's really a nice old desk, and I always say maybe Colonel Crawford sat at this desk. I don't know that for sure, but uh, 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 we have this here candle here, this candle holder. My mother used to take this upstairs to bed with her as her light to go upstairs. Now they didn't have electricity, so she carried the light with her uh, to go up to bed. Of course, we all know what this is, the ancient old ironing, iron, and uh, that's quite a piece there. And I, I don't know what else to tell you, just uh, my my cups. And uh, and I always claim this is uh, the Mayflower, John Adam Metzger come across the ocean on, no. Uh, it's just Mark talking. <laughs> and. <laughs> And uh, I do know we have the old wooden rake, and uh, they used to be here, and so that's the story on the old desk there. And uh, when my children were growing up here, I might say this, our dog had eight pups, and I told the kids to each get two pups and stand out in the, by the barn hill, and Ron is all she could do to hang on to hers there, <laughs> but... Uh, uh, we that was an unusual thing. They each the dog had eight pups, and they each could hold two pups. Mm -hmm. And uh, and this is when I. They picked up more ground to farm. Mm -hmm. They're mm -hmm. rented farm, rented more land. Sure. So I rented more land and sold the cows. Mm -hmm. And uh, but it, but the cows become part of your life, you know, when they. He's out here in this field and there's grazing and and uh, I knew the man was coming with a truck to get the uh, cows that day. I sold them to another dairy in Continental. Okay. And I cried. I thought. Yeah, that was the end of something. Yeah, they're gonna miss but seeing them out there. I, but I had my mind made up. That was that's what I was gonna do. Yeah, yeah. So we sold the cows and it turned out okay. Yeah. But then you're not sure when when you're doing it. You oh, know. Yeah.